Wow! A movie like this actually exists. Ugh. Hey everyone, welcome to the review. Here's my review for the movie Cell. Yes, the movie, the movie Cell. Yes, this movie Cell stars John Cusack and Samuel L. Jackson. And this movie is based off a Stephen King adaptation. Yes, John Cusack and Samuel L. Jackson in a Stephen King movie. Where have we seen that before? Yes, 1408. A very awesome, pretty underrated ghost story of a movie. Awesome movie. Now we get the movie Cell, which is like a on-demand movie. And the story of this movie, believe it or not, the story of the movie Cell is about people's cell phones turning them into zombies. I am not making that up. Cell phones turning people into zombies. <sighs> this movie, this movie is hands down one of the worst pile of asses I've ever seen this fucking year. Nor of the North has some competition because Cell is a stupid movie. I was uh, recommended to see this movie. A friend of mine's like, you gotta watch the movie Cell. It is so stupid. You gotta watch it. It is hilariously bad. It's like The Room and Battlefield Earth and Batman and Robin. I'm like, really? Okay, okay, I'll check it out. Honestly, he's absolutely right. This movie is so freaking funny. Unintentionally funny. It's like watching The Wicker Man and The Happening and stuff. It is so stupid and ridiculous. It's kind of it's kind of funny. Mostly in the first act, that's when it's really funny. Like watching these random people turn into zombies in the airport with their <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, what the fuck? Even the zombies when they walk, they're like <laughs> I'm like, what the hell? And what am I watching? What is this movie? And Joey Cusack, throughout the whole movie, I feel like John Cusack was just like, you know, forced to be there. He just like, oh god, why am I doing this movie? I'm better than this. Well, of course you are, but you're doing it. And Sam Jackson, Sam Jackson's kind of there. He plays this ex-soldier, basically helps John Cusack, and they have no chemistry whatsoever. And almost every line of dialogue they say to each other comes off so awkward and weird. It just a lot of this movie is awkward and weird because then there's a girl that comes. She like lives upstairs of John Cusack, and she's kind of like stalking him, and it's just weird. And they get this little kid, and I don't know why he's there. He's just there. Then they go to a bar full of rednecks. Then they turn to zombies and. Just stuff in this movie makes no sense, and, and the way that then they start like making rules up about these zombies, and it makes even less sense. Nothing about this movie makes sense. I felt like Stephen King is one of the writers to this movie. Stop making him write movies, cause he I don't know if he knows what he's talking about. I don't know what kind of drugs he's on when he's writing these movies. It's just it, it's fucking idiotic. This movie. This movie is so stupid. Right from the opening credits, I knew this movie would suck. The opening credits are so horribly done. I felt like a 10-year-old did the editing for this movie. It did the opening credits to this movie. It is so ugly and sloppily handled. It's just fucking terrible and ugly as shit. The editing is also so choppy. The, sh the shaky cam in this movie is absolutely atrocious. Some of the shots, I had no idea what the fuck was happening. It was just cut, 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 shake, 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 cut, 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 shake, shake, shake. I'm like, what? Slow the fuck down, movie. There's even some lighting issues. The light just goes right into the camera. You have no idea what the fuck you're watching. Oh my god. Again, some of this acting in this movie. It's funny. It's hilarious. This movie is hilariously bad. There's this one guy. He's on the train. It's in the beginning of the movie. He literally dies in 20 seconds, but the 20 seconds of screen time this guy has is freaking hilarious. He's this douchey character, but he is so funny. It was so funny because how stupid his character is. I'm like, oh my god. This movie's fucking awful. And it's a movie you kind of gotta... You have to watch. You have to experience it because it's a movie you have to see to believe that it's actually real. A movie about cell phones turning you into zombies. It's ridiculous. It's so dumb. The movie makes no sense. There's nothing about this movie that makes sense. The ending really doesn't make sense. This movie is stupid. It's awful. Why does this movie exist? It was entertaining, yeah, because it was so stupid. It's like the happening in The Waker Man. But why does this exist? Why, Stephen King? Why did you write the book? And why did you have to adapt it into this anus of a movie? It's awful. Awful. So, yeah, on a scale of 1 to 10, I'll, of course, give the movie Cell a 1 out of 10. It's terrible.
So yeah, that's my review for the movie. The movie Cell. So yeah, in the comment section below, please tell me. Did you see this movie? If you did, tell me what you thought of it. Comment below. Let me know. And as always, if you like this video, please like, subscribe to this channel, and join the dark side.